that you said was that before you were able to start booking bigger, higher profile jobs, you would do kind of like the, you know, very introductory gigs of whatever you could get, including corporate videos. (laughs) What are corp? I had never heard of this. Like I knew, you know, you say commercials or short films. I'm like, oh yeah, I know what that is. And then you said corporate, like what are corporate acting gigs? Corporate videos are like, you know, when you go for a job and you've got like training videos. So they'll be like, this is how you behave in the workplace or this is how to speak to your co-workers or, you know, or this is the training that we do in this company. That's what basically corporate videos are. They're like internal videos that you do for any company um, that do internal training. But they pay like, for, you know, at, at that level as an actor, they pay quite well and they can be quite fun. But yeah, it's proper like entry level. Nobody ever sees it. You know, you don't talk about it. You don't get any exposure from it. But it's like, yeah, somebody booked me to do a job and I'm being paid to act. So sweet. But nowadays, you never know. I mean, if you blow up and then you go on, let's say, Graham Norton, he might find yeah. those or his not him, but his team. They might go yeah. digging into like, your back catalog, <laughs> play those just to embarrass I, you on television. I would love him to do that. I would think it would be hilarious to look back at some of the corporate videos I've done. And they get you to say all of this jargon that nobody understands. And you have to learn all this dialogue where you're reaming off all of this technical workplace jargon. No one knew what they were saying, but you just sort of got to do it with the noddy smiley face and like be really cor- corporate about it. Um, I like being embarrassed. It keeps you grounded. So I'm up for it. 